Hey Indian Hills, it's Mrs. Sanders Feld Miller with some new books here. So we're gonna start off with some uh, new books in series. So we have Evil Spy School. This one is book three in the graphic novel version of the Spy School series. We have the newest Dog Man, The Scarlet Shutter. This one is book number 12. We have the newest book in the Black Clover series, which is number 34, and the newest book in My Hero Academia, which is number 37. So those are some new books in series. We also have A for Effort, which is a new book by Jared Green, and he is the um, author of AOK, -OK, which is one of our Iowa Teen Award books for this year. And so this is his new graphic novel, not technically a sequel, but kind of very similar to um, AOK. -OK. And then we just got in some more copies of The Flip Side by Sean Johnson. You know, we have the Sean Johnson statue and display in our library. We used to have this book that she wrote, but our copies got lost. So it finally came back into print, got a new couple uh, new copies of it. And then Coyote Lost and Found. This one was um, Coyote Sunrise was an Iowa Teen Award book a few years ago. This one is a sequel to that. So her, it's about Coyote and her dad and more adventures on their school bus camper. Next up, we have some chapter books. So the first one here is Snow Globe. Snow Globe is described as a cross between Hunger Games and the Squid Games. So it's a little bit futuristic, a little bit dystopian. There's a little bit of fight for survival um, type of thing. So, and it's got kind of um, some Korean background to it as well. So it's a little bit of a good diverse read. Um, then we have Between Two Brothers. Between Two Brothers is about uh, two brothers, obviously, who uh, end up getting in a fight. So they're pretty close. They love each other a lot, uh, but they get into a really bad fight one day. And the one brother that, that's the main character of the book decides, you know what, I need to apologize. I don't want this rift to be between us. But then before he gets a chance to apologize, his brother's in a very bad car accident. Um, so then he's dealing with the uh, questions about if he's going to be able to apologize to his brother. Um, if his brother ever wakes up in the hospital and he has a lot of guilt about feeling feeling bad about how the last interaction went between them. Uh, the Misfits, this one is one about a kid who goes to a new school and when they get to the new school they find out that it is a kind of a training camp for spies. Um, and there's a mystery that's going to try and shut down the school, uh, but this character really enjoys what they're learning at the school and doesn't want the school to go down. So they're trying to solve this mystery and save the school. Um, Airlock, this one is one of the quick pick books. So nice short chapters, not a ton of words on a page. It's a sci-fi futuristic, um, they go to the moon type of thing, but he's a stowaway on the ship that goes to the moon and then the ship gets hijacked. And since nobody knows that he's on the ship, he feels like it's his responsibility to try and take back the ship and save the people. Then we have a biography. This one back here is called Unstoppable. This one is the story of Maggie Nichols. And Maggie Nichols was a USA gymnast and she grew up in the Twin Cities area, Minneapolis, St. Paul area, and trained originally with her gymnastics there until she made the national team. And then she moved to Texas to train with USA Gymnastics. Um, but she had a lot of hard things happen to her. She had to deal with injuries. Um, she was the first person to come forward and say that she had been abused by one of the athletic trainers. Um, and so she was considered athlete A in that case. But because she came forward, tons and tons of other girls and women came forward and said, yes, this person had also abused them. And that got that person sent to jail. And then the girl in white, this one is a horror kind of mystery thriller, just a good creepy book about a town who prides itself on being haunted, but this girl who moves to this new town uh, wants to figure out what the deal with the ghosts are. So if any of these books look good, come to the library to check them out or get on Destiny Discover and place them on hold.